I, you don't need me to talk, right? Because no, you know. You don't. You can I talk, mean. But... So use a, a pound of ground chuck with about a cup to about a cup and a quarter of rice, I'd say. Oh, that meat's still frozen. I lost my microphone. Oh no! All of a sudden, I don't know where it is. I've been looking for it. Okay, I put in the cup and a quarter of rice and so just let it kind of overflow, and then. Probably about, oh, my eyes just squeeze these. I don't like them so big. They usually get pretty messy. I usually do about a half to three quarters of a can. I'll okay. see what's left. <laughs> I'm getting twisted. <laughs> okay, and then just salt and pepper. Mm. Probably okay. about a half a tablespoon. All right. And then probably about a, I don't know, quarter of a teaspoon or so of pepper. Okay. And then just mix it up. And then as you go, you can tell, like whether it needs more tomatoes or more rice if it looks too like meaty. You know, there's all meat and no rice and I add a little more, but I think we're okay. Okay. Okay, now we're just ready to roll them. All right. Okay, so. Explain how you're doing this. So you put them down. The smooth, yeah, smooth I, yeah. Side down. Put the yeah the the regular side. And so the veiny about, side up. Yeah, put about a tablespoon or two, and then just kind of roll them tightly, and whoop, put them in the pan. I kind of like to roll them as tight as I can, otherwise I think they're a little mushy. Can we show this real quick? Here, like yeah. show that how that you put the leaves yeah. on the bottom so that it's not right. doesn't get burned, and then you start to put the the grape leaves around the around and keep going in a circle or put them as tightly together as you can because you don't if you don't then you got extra water in there that you don't need. Start helping okay, you. this will take me about a half an hour. <laughs> really? Yeah. Well, yeah, pretty, pretty close, Hi, yeah. Hi, Mira. Hi, sweetie. Hi, what are you, What are you looking for? What are you looking huh? for? What are we doing? We're making grape leaves. Want to look? Look. I hate grape leaves. I hate grape leaves. <laughs> <laughs> you do not. You just ate your lunch. We're supposed to wait till three for your snack, honey. Okay. Fine. Okay, fine. fine. <laughs> you be a good girl. <laughs> We're waiting. You're good. <laughs> this is sweet. I like to come out in the kitchen once in a while and kind of roll around. Mine's are, my, I just made one, but mine is fatter. <laughs> you made what? <laughs> Mine's fatter. <laughs> Bigger. Well, yours are a little chubbier, but that's okay. Yeah. It doesn't matter. I like it. I like it rolled tight and thin like that. I like them kind of tight, like the size of like a cigar, kind of like a small cigar, I guess. I never knew Nicole liked grape leaves so much. Oh my gosh. I know. She just always what she wants when she comes to the visit. All right. Well, how about that? Now, should we just go ahead and cook them? Go this way. So, okay. well, then. that's what it looks oh, like. Just want to. Oh, that is about perfect. You want to make sure that it's all covered, and they are. 
Okay, and then just put your plate on. Okay, so this should, ah, perfect. Okay. Do you press it? Yeah. That's it then, they can put them on the stove. You bring it to a boil, right? Right, bring it to, start on high heat. Let it simmer for about, turn it down, keep it covered, let it simmer for about a half a, I usually check after 25 minutes to see, to make sure. And you put yours there, and put a little salt. I don't know why I never salt anything, but I always salt grape leaves. Do you want to put some lemon juice on it? Yes, I do. Very good. Yeah, very good. Mm. Well, you don't have to worry about the rest of the day. <laughs> you can eat your mm. grape leaves and Amira's got her chicken fingers in there. Too bad she won't eat stuff like this, but I know she I won't. Know. Oh, uh, 